Hello there, it's Louise with you of Timeless Craft Mama, and today I'm sharing a scrapbook layout process video created for Scrapbook Boutique. And I am doing something a little different. I'm actually creating a page featuring myself. I've recently just discovered Snapchat filters, so I apologize. I am a little late to the party, but um, I find it's a really um, cute way to get a picture of myself that I can put into a scrapbook page and I think my kids will like looking back on it um, down the track when they have a bit of a, a squizzy through some of the albums that I'm creating. So today I'm working with the Kayser Craft Misty Mountains collection and it's this beautiful combination of purples and like a little bit of a coral colour and then some pops of gold as well. So I'm having a bit of a look at some of the collectible items and these are probably one of my favorite things to add to a page because they're already die cut for you. Um, there's lots of little sayings, lots of easy ways to actually enhance um, your layout without having to work very hard to create. So if I'm buying a paper collection, I will normally pick up the die cuts as well because it just makes the whole process of creating that much easier. Now you'll also see I've used a cut file in the background, so I've got that um, circular floral element um, and you can see a link to that over on the blog at Scrapbook Boutique. Um, what I decided to do was actually uh, cut the background out of the paper and then back it with something else. So you could do this in two ways. So you could actually back the cut file and then attach it over the top of the white piece of paper. But I decided that I was gonna cut that center piece of paper out and then actually add um, some coordinating paper behind it. Now I go back and forwards a little bit on the coordinating paper. I have a bit of a look, um, you know, I think about it, some of the options jump out at me, but I really like the paper that I end up with. And it was, it was hard to choose because there are some beautiful patterns and beautiful papers um, in this collection. So if you haven't picked up Misty Mountain from Kayser Craft, get in quick because I don't think it'll last long. It's really um, a fabulous collection. And, you know, I think one now that I'm looking at the final layout, I, I really like the choice that I made. This particular paper that I'm going to use to back with now, um, it's definitely the, the pick of sort of what I had available um, and the way I wanted the layout to look. So I love this. I really like the way the, um, the color blends and flows and changes. It's got that pink, but it's also got the purple as well. And it just looks beautiful behind that cut file. Now, what I struggled with a little bit here was I've, I've made this really nice page, but how am I going to title and journal it? So what am I going to um, actually do with the page to turn it into a finished page? So, you know, sometimes um, when I'm scrapping, I may have an idea in mind. I may sort of think about what I'm doing as I go along, but other times I just wing it and actually just create as I go. So Certainly in this case, it was winging it and just having a play around with the elements that I had available. The sticker sheet is wonderful. It's really such an easy way to actually add elements. So I end up titling this page, My Dreams 2018. And a little bit um, down the track, you'll actually see, I'm going to flip the page over and show you where I've actually journaled some of my thoughts about 2018, some of the things we've got going on in our life, some of my not so much dreams but um, feelings and thoughts about the actual um, year of 2018. So uh, the layout itself doesn't have anything particularly difficult um, but I think that recording and getting back to basics and creating a memory is more important in this particular um, creation that I've made. So I hope you enjoyed watching that. Thank you so much for visiting. Don't forget to subscribe and of course check out Scrapbook Boutique for all the items used in this video.